I'm Jonathan Garnham. I run the gallery Blank Projects in Cape Town. Uh, a little bit about the history of Blank. It started as an artist-run project space operate, operating on a non-profit basis from 2005 to 2012. And during 2012, we made the transition into a commercial gallery. When I was working as an artist, practicing as an artist, I certainly didn't have the money to buy artworks. Um, some works uh, were gifted or swapped um, with artists, some of whom have gone on to be um, pretty well known. I would frequent the, the art schools, the end of year exhibitions, and often, well just about every year I'd buy some work or works from, from that. That's also simply because that's all I could afford at the time. I was uh, teaching and uh, didn't have that much of that, that much disposable income, so I bought works that I could afford, and um, slowly, I guess, a collection started forming without necessarily much direction. I was simply buying things that I thought were good. I recently bought a beautiful little uh, Jared Sokoto collage, which is a very humble work, quite obscure, but um, I, you know, that's one of these works that, have, that, that give the collection of mine a bit of context, and it's quite interesting seeing uh, the connections, perhaps, between a work that was made in 1966, uh, uh, the connection with the work that was made in 2019, for example, you know, how, how art can span that uh, time frame, how people are, artists are dealing with similar issues. And, but I also collect weird things, you know, I'll collect uh, objects, I really have a thing for objects and uh, strange objects, things that uh, fascinate me, or things that I wonder what they are, or, um, so, it's not really part of my art collection, but it is something that I collect. I think uh, what I have noticed locally in South Africa, if I look back to uh, the landscape here 15 years ago, things have changed dramatically. Um, 15, 20 years ago, we didn't really have a, a group of galleries working internationally, working pro professionally, representing artists. And if I look at things in five-year steps, uh, how far we've come. We've now got an, a small established gallery scene. We have three institu private institutions in Cape Town, together with the Zico South African National Gallery. We have an annual art fair and I think a combination of all of these things, especially the art fairs, I think that people feel they're a lot more accessible and uh, then they might be intimidated going into a gallery, but an art fair somehow feels a bit uh, yeah, more accessible. I think that you, we are having, getting people in South Africa who are beginning to know more, who are taking, certainly taking more interest in contemporary art, hopefully being less intimidated by it and starting to form their own opinions and hopefully also their own collections. Challenge yourself, push yourself as a collector. Um, don't be shy to ask questions, you know, through artists, gallerists, curators. And read a lot, inform yourself, talk to an expert. Uh, someone who really knows art